Hello and welcome back to Gage Plays. Ah, some more Skyrim VR. So, what shall we Erlin do now? Well, we could go play Dawn Guard, but I think I'm gonna skip that for the moment. You know, how about we actually go visit the Greybeards? Or should I actually instead go take care of the uh, poor lady Saudi over in uh, Whiterun. Let's do that. All right, so if I go up, I think it opens to the top of the castle. I, I don't know why I'm delaying going to meet the Greybeards. I'm at a level where I can make it up there now. I think the Alakir might actually have a little bit of a thing for me. If, if everything scales like they say it does, the, the Alakir may actually have a good chance at kicking my ass into the next kingdom. Okay, whoop, wrong button. We want the map. All right, so off to White Run we go. Yes. But yeah, eventually I'll get over to High Hrothgar. And I don't know, I don't think I joined the Storm Cloaks yet. I'll have to check my, uh, my, uh, uh stuff. Because, uh, while I, I like, I don't like the Empire, the Storm Cloaks seem to be, I don't know, racist as fuck. Okay. So, that should be the Bannered Mare. Right? Bannered Mare? Yes. Okay. Sadi, what is it? Sadi? Sadia? I can't remember her name. Come on in. Let me know if you need anything or take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. There she is. Yes. Sadia. Um, did you know there's some Alakir warriors Are you looking? Sure? Yes. Please, we need to speak in private. Okay, I will follow you, since I somehow accidentally skipped your entire dialogue about following you and speaking in private. Working with them? You think you can take me? You so much as touch me and you're going to lose fingers. <laughs> I mean it. Spicy. I'll, I'll cut you in half. So the Alakir know where I am? What do they offer you? Gold? How many more of them are coming? Tell me. God damn that bard. <laughs> anyway, I'm not going to hurt you. I can trust here in the city. Okay, what do you want? I am not the person that the people of White Run think I am. Oh, yeah? My real name is Eamon. I am a noble of House Suda in Hammerfell. The men who are looking for me, the Alakir, they are assassins in the employ of the Almeri Dominion. They wish to exchange my blood for gold. I need you to root them out and drive them away before they find me and drag me back to Hammerfell for an execution. The funny thing is, is the Alakir say the exact opposite. They're only in it for the money. They're led by a man named Kamatu. Get rid of him and the rest will scatter. That is doable. Face, lest they recognize me. So you'll have to find out where they are. Oh, I have a ring. <laughs> Sorry. How do I, I find him? One of them was just arrested trying to sneak into the city. If he's locked up in the jail, perhaps you can get it out of him. Please. That I shall do. I know I'm asking you to do something difficult, maybe even dangerous. I just don't know who else I can trust. Why are they after you? I don't know for sure. I spoke out against the Aldmeri Dominion publicly. I suspect that's why these men were hired to hunt me See. Down. And they claim that she actually helped them. Okay. Why don't you go you to think the guards? I'd be in hiding if this was something I trusted town guards to handle? These men are ruthless, cunning, deceitful. They'll pay off whoever they can. I can't trust anyone here in White Run. Makes sense. Guards and yarls can be bought. And the Alakir are close. I'm running out of time, so I'm choosing to trust you. Well, in that case, I'm gonna do it. You'll find me the moment the Alakir are taken care of. 
Is she saying, I swear I'll cut you in half? Nope. Okay. Because afterwards, there's a few times where she says that. Like, I swear I'll cut you in half. Like, even after you tell her you're going to help her. Uh, so, a new product I'm testing is, um, it's, oh god, is it awesome. It's a facial interface for VR. Uh, so, I have the regular one with um, silicone slip covers I put on. But this one, this one is cooling gel. And oh, is it nice. Why am I doing... Oh, yes, I need to go up to the jail. Ah, uh, the mountains. And there's High, Hoth High Hrothgar all the way up there. You can actually see it. Okay, so the jail is straight back on the left, I think. It's been a while. All right. Yes, there it is. To the dungeon! Boy, that is some moody dark lighting. Are you in here? No. Where is he? Also, oop, wrong button. Okay, speak with the Alakir leader. All right, saw that, well, let's see. So, are you in here? Why are you not showing up in any of the cells? That dude is dead and naked. Where is the Alakir warrior? I see you guards. Oh, there he is. What are you looking at? I need to you find Kamada. Death wish then? If you know that name, you must know to meet him would be to meet your end. Ooh. But it seems we both have needs, friend. Spicy. Perhaps we can help each other out. <laughs> what is it you want? I have dishonored my brothers by being captured. So they have left me here. My life with the Alakir is over now. But I have no wish to die in this god's forsaken land. If I can be released from prison, I may start over. See to that, and I'll tell you what you want to know. How much to pay your fine? gold will secure my release. You can afford that, can't you? Of course. I suppose you'd better hope you can, if you want the information. You know, I'd love to just let you rot guards, in here anyway. I'll tell you what you want to know. All right, hold on. Why'd they leave you? I was clumsy enough to be captured. <sighs> Excuse me. Says, we're supposed to be the best of the best. I wasn't. You were bested. All right. Mm -hmm. Until next time. Yep. Hey, guard. Are uh, they reforming the Dawn Guard? Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften? Might consider joining up myself. I might too. Sometime. Done. Convince him to stay out of the city while you're at it. Will do. Alright. You better be worth the gold, bitch. You buy my way out of here, and I'll tell you what you want to know. I did! <laughs> Very well. Kamatu is west of White Room. It's an unassuming little cave called Swindler's Den. You realize if you set foot in there, you're never coming back out. They'll kill you. But that's your problem. Not mine. Alright. Anyway. So, here we go. Now, um, this door. Yep, takes me back up to Dragon's Reach. Alright. What am I, how am I armed? Um, okay, I have the glass maze. Ooh, what did I throw on it again? Oh yes, yeah, soul gem. Okay. I have elven armor. I need to find more elven armor. Like, I forgot I'm like a light armor person at the moment. Which is funny because apparently the spell sword was given a boost in heavy armor and I didn't even look at that. Uh, but the alternate start is cool. In fact, I found the mod for the alternate start that they have on this and I put it on the flat screen version. I'm so sad that you can't mod like the Switch, though. 
because I bought this on the Switch, but the Switch is still fun for other reasons. Okay, this is going to require a jump cut, because <laughs> no matter what, it's going to take a bit to get there. Okay, they said near Rorik's Den, so I'll see you as soon as I hit Swindler's Den. See you then. Okay, welcome back. We're just right in front of Swindler's Den. Nothing too interesting happened. I got attacked by a giant spider, and... Hi. Oh yeah, they are leveled. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I got attacked by a giant spider and a Boetha cultist. And the Boetha cultist caused a... Um... A... Quest. Let's see. Yep, kill Kimatu. Hi. Oops. Come on, man. Die. And you. That bow and arrow. Ah. Soul was discarded. You guys got anything good on you? Oh, I'll take the iron arrows. And the gold. How about you? Gold. And a pickaxe, huh? Okay. Can I pick her off? Really? It's over here. Nothing. Yeah, I'm going to die to the Alec here. Anyway. Alright, let's get out of there. Just use my quick menu. Alright, we're gonna drop a quick save. <laughs> she full of arrows. But then again, I'll bet you I am. Iron arrows. Huh. So yeah, the 17 iron arrows included the one sticking out of her. That is too funny. Skeever on a stick. I thought that was a booby trap for a second. All right. I need to check my arrows. What am I using? Iron arrows, huh? Okay. What was that? All right. Time to change tactic. Glass mace. Oof, I don't like that lightning. I need to get up there to him. How do I get up to you? Well, I 
I don't need to worry about sneaking now. Oh. That was fun. So the Alec here know I'm here. Nothing. So this is going to be interesting. We are going to do a quick save. trip to bear trap. Alright. Oh yeah? Uh, and talk. Stay your hand, warrior. It's no secret why you're here. And you have proven your skill in combat. Let us talk a moment. No one else needs to die. I think we can all profit from the situation in which we find ourselves. I'm not entirely I sure I believe you. I attack you if you will lower your weapons. She sold the city out to the Almeri Dominion. See, I don't believe it. But not for her betrayal. Tanit could have held its ground in the war. The other noble houses discovered her betrayal and she fled. They want her brought back alive. The See. resistance against the Dominion is alive and well in Hammerfell. They want justice. See, I don't believe this. All right, so. Where are you at? Come on, you all. Come on. Fuck. So many of them. Okay, I'm getting good at being light on my feet at least. <laughs> I was not expecting to win that. All right. Simtar. Simitar. 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 So, remember how I killed I don't know if that actually made the cut or not. Like, okay. I take the gold. Anyway, what I'm saying is, I don't know if that made the cut or not, was, uh, I saw two, uh, Alakir hassling a Redguard woman. And I killed the Alakir, and next thing you know, I walked by some, uh, Alderi Dominion, you know, some Thalmor, and they just immediately started attacking me for no reason. <gasps> Ooh, okay. Let's take them on. I know those enemy boots are heavy, but if I can disenchant them, I will absolutely do so. Okay. I think I might run into one or two more bandits going this way. I don't know. I may have cleared them all out. Is that a wood axe? No, that's arrows. More iron arrows. I have like, what, 172 of them. Okay, um... I 
I don't recall. Let's see. Is this the way out? No. This has got to be the way out. Yep. There we go. Big floating door explains it all. All right. Sheath the weapon. Go to Sadia. And then I think, yeah, we'll go visit uh, High Hrothgar. Because, you know what? What I'll do is I'll make it up to the top to High, H High Hrothgar, and then I'll call it an episode. Then we can start the next episode with me doing training with the, uh, with the Greybeards. Yes. Hello. I'm glad you ain't... Uh, you know, that's the one patch I like, is that not everybody turns and starts talking to you. Like, that... When you get so many overlapping voices, at times it can be just... Obnoxious. Well, you're all leaving the bannered mare. What time in the morning is it? Hi. Uh, five in the morning. Okay, well that makes sense. One of the first songs I ever learned. Ragnar the Red. So I'm assuming then she's gonna be up in her bed. Is that what is that? Forge numbers, bitches. No, what? Why would I do that? Guess what? You ain't got nothing to worry about anymore. At last, I can rest safely. You have done me a great service, warrior. I cannot thank you enough. Take this reward. I managed to sneak some of my wealth out of Hammerfell when I left. It's the least I can do. For now, I will maintain my ruse here. You are always welcome in the Banner of Mayor. Aww. 500 gold, not bad. <laughs> I mean, I've made, I've made more for, I've made more for less, but I mean, I'm glad I helped a person in need. Again, I do not believe at all that she betrayed them to the Dominion. I, I, I want to say that, like, the Alakir warriors were, uh, lying as such. I mean... Would you believe a bunch of people hold up with bandits? All right. So, I'm not going to jump cut because we're gonna we're gonna take those seven thousand steps up to High Hrothgar together. The Greybeards have summoned the Dragonborn to High Hrothgar. Yep. Such a thing has not happened for hundreds of years. Yes. You know what I'm concerned about is that I have not been attacked by cultists. Oh, you know why? <laughs> it could be because I don't have the, uh... The way of the voice set? I don't know. We'll see. Because usually when I enter Iverstead, I get met by cultists, and a fight breaks out, and somehow I accidentally injure guards, and I end up getting thrown in prison. You can't tell her what to do. She's our only child, Bolton. Am I to throw her to the wolves? You're hardly throwing her to the wolves. Oh, I'll have to... I'll, in, I'll intervene eventually. On your way up the 7,000 steps again, Clement? Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar? About to... I've been to the monastery many times, but I've never even laid eyes on one of the Greybeards. Not that I'd care to. Eh. Being masters of the Thulm, they could kill you by uttering a single word. Well, yeah. not that they would. They seem peaceful, but I wouldn't want to provoke them. Oh, I like provocation. Okay. What type of deliveries? Most food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Yeah. And in return? Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be. Climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. I'll do it for you. Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Here, 
Take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. Will do? All right. Not so. Today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to high rock the path, the path is indeed not safe. So, anyway. I could stop and read every one of these little things, but I think that would bore you all to tears. So, we are just going to make the 7,000 steps. I don't really think there's 7,000. A bear? Really? I stole your soul. Take it all. Oh, that's right. I didn't go and disenchant any of the stuff I was going to take a look at and see if it was disenchantable. I have a feeling I already have the enchantment, so no. Okay, a bear at the start. That's not promising. Oh, look at that mountain goat. Anyway, I love the view. Like, the view up here is so cool, and I love that, you know, the level of detail and things fades off, and it just, it looks really interesting. Ha! An actual person. Sheathe your weapon. Do not accidentally fire breathe them. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. Means I'm going up there. What are you doing? I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emeralds. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. Nah, I can't say I blame you. Anyway, thank you I... for visiting. All right. Sooner or later, I'm sure I'm going to meet a saber cat. And I guess that'll be the sooner. Oh, what? You're new. Oh. Yeah, see, the first time I tried to do this, like, oh, I think it was in my other playthrough. You, I think you would have seen me try this. But, oh, hey, damn, it scared me. Come here, Ray. Come on. Yes. Anyway, oh, I stole its soul. The first time I ran into a saber cat. First thing up, um, not too far from here actually. Saber cat killed me, killed me, and killed me, and killed me. Then I blew like all of my healing potions and was able to kill it. To run into a frost troll later who just destroyed my ass. So that's why I was surprised to see a frost troll so easy on this uh, path. They're so easy, so early. I can't words. I'm minorly out of it. It's probably a frost troll or a f snow bear or whatever the hell. I think it's the frost troll. I'm just surprised I've seen an extra one today. Where's the snow cat? The saber cat should have been around here by now. Oh. So around here, I'll meet a, a nice lady meditating on some of these. Ah, there they are. Again, she the weapon. Well, hello. Huh? I was just outside Iverstead when it happened. It's an exciting moment. Nothing like this has happened in centuries. Yeah, I'm, 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 okay. What are you doing? Walking the steps, meditating on the emblems. I make this trip every few years. Hmm, nice. Okay, I'd ask who you Good are, day. but I don't care. <laughs> Good day. All right, so the frost troll's up here then. Where the hell was this? Okay, 
I'm assuming the enemy placement is randomized. That's my only thought, except for that snow troll up here, that frost troll is... I, I'm pretty sure he's hand placed. Because here is the frost troll. Yep. I see your big wonky ass butt up there. Are you going to come down? Yeah, you're just going to fall down. Ow! Getting a little better at actually physically dodging. All right. Really? I'm going to have to fill my mace back up? Okay. So, I know this will be a short episode, because like I said, once I make it to High Hrothgar, I'm going to call it an episode, but I figured, you know, 7,000 steps is definitely one of those times like you, you know, pretending the walking simulator is not so bad. But I was glad I had a little energy left over today. I had to make some runs and deal with people, and that is always so, so draining. I wouldn't be so pedantic as to go back and count each one of these. I just keep thinking, there can't possibly be 7,000 steps. Also, where the hell are the ice wolves? I haven't run into the, like, the snow cat, no ice wolves. Oh, check that out. You can see all the way down. Um, holy shit. We, we must not be too far from Hrothgar. There it is, actually, because I can see Whiterun from here. Uh, yep, there it is. Do I have any more things I need to beat the snot out of before I make it? It don't appear so. So. I know this is a short episode, but I, like I said, I, I had some energy, but not a lot. I, I'm kind of low on energy. All right. So we want to put the supplies in, which should show up in the special items area. Climic supplies, yes. There we go. Return to Klimic and Iverstead. I shall do that at another time. Right now I'm going to drop a hard save and say thank you for hanging out with me. And we will continue on with the way of the voice next time. Alright. And yeah, just save over that save. Alright. Thanks for watching.